At the beginning of the trading session, the euro showed a sharp decline, despite quite strong fundamental data. The final data on the Eurozone manufacturing PMI unveiled that the indicator dropped to 54.8 points from 55.2. Analysts had foreseen a decrease to 54.7. At the same time, the Eurozone unemployment rate remained unchanged as expected. Nevertheless, the single currency began sliding against the US dollar. Importantly, the pound sterling is still trading near the levels locked at the end of the previous week. However, it has reasons to rise. The fact is that the UK's manufacturing PMI decreased to 54.1 points from 57.5. The preliminary estimate showed a decline to 52.9 points. Notably, market participants had already priced in the preliminary data. A drop in the euro took place just in time of the publication of the revised inflation forecasts. At the end of the previous week, economists predicted that inflation in January would total 0.1%. This data was expected to stop a five-month period of deflation. This is a really positive factor. However, just after the beginning of the European session, the forecast was significantly revised. Thus, the eurozone inflation may rise 2.3% or even 0.5%. In December, deflation reached 0.3%. However, investors began selling off the euro, showing their skeptical attitude to such positive predictions. In fact, investors are concerned about such a sharp change in the figures. They doubt that predictions made by the European Central Bank and Eurostat are true. This has pushed them to sell off the euro. Today, the United States will also disclose its manufacturing PMI. Analysts foresee a rise. The US business activity data may also beat the forecast following the eurozone and the UK. Notably, economists expect the highest reading in the last six years. If the data exceeds the forecast, the US dollar may skyrocket against both the euro and the pound Stalin. And let's take a look at the trading chart. On Friday, the euro-dollar pair began rising towards the level of 1.2150. The quote is still hovering between the levels of 1.2050 and 1.2190. Analyzing the current chart, we can see that the price is sliding. The pair is likely to continue trading within the range of 1.2050 and 1.2190 during the day. Thus, traders may open positions after a rebound from the mentioned limits. However, the strategy based on a break of either border is less risky. Importantly, the signal that proves a break of either limit will appear after the price fixation on the 4 hour chart. At the same time, the pound dollar pair is still trading at the peak of the midterm trend. The high of 1.3750 continues. Uh, we hang uh, on buyers. Uh, this leads to a slump in the volume of long positions and lower price. On the chart, we can see that the pair dropped from the high of 1.3750. If the price goes on uh, falling, it may reach the level of 1.3650. According to the alternative scenario, the pair may continue gaining in value if it consolidates above 1.3760 on a daily chart. And that's all for now. We keep monitoring the financial market situation. Subscribe to our channel and see you in several hours. We will take a close look at the US trading session.